Hey, good Sunday afternoon, everyone. Storm Team Meteorologist Griffin Hardy here in the CBS 42 Storm Team Weather Center with a quick weather update. A lot of low-level moisture sticking around in Alabama for today. We are back behind the remnants of Delta that is now passing up to the northeast of us and just now starting to see some breaks in the clouds. We've been seeing clouds and drizzle all day long today, but conditions are improving as more drier air begins to stream in from the northwest. You can see Delta there, or at least what's left of it, that post-tropical low up in Tennessee, still producing a lot of thunderstorms on the eastern side of it, where winds are out of the south. There's a lot of moisture on that side, so North Carolina, Virginia, South Carolina, all seeing a lot more heavy rain today. And Georgia saw a lot of impacts yesterday with some spin-up tornadoes. Thankfully, we didn't see that much in Alabama. Uh, we stayed pretty quiet. Uh, part of the cloudy skies, rest of the night tonight, clouds gradually clearing out. We'll see more sunshine than not starting tomorrow. And temperatures tonight staying pretty warm thanks to a lot of that moisture sticking around. It's going to be pretty muggy out there, only cooling down to the mid-60s tomorrow morning. Again, tomorrow afternoon, sunshine returns. More sunshine than not across most of the region. And most of us, if not all of us, should get up into the 80s. 85 tomorrow here in Birmingham, 82 towards Gadsden and Coleman up to the north. And down to the south, it'll be especially warm in Tuscaloosa, 80. 87 in Tuscaloosa and Moundville for tomorrow. So warming up pretty nicely as more of that sunshine comes out. Most of the week ahead will be pretty dry. We'll have two cold fronts that pass through, one Tuesday and one Thursday night. The first one won't really do all that much, but the second one will give us the much looking, the, the cool down that we'll be really looking for. So here's the full seven day forecast. You'll notice the cooler temperatures in the morning early in this early in the week, but uh, in the afternoon it's still going to be pretty warm with most of us seeing highs in the 80s. Then a couple morning showers Friday with that bigger cold front that passes through. And Saturday and Sunday next weekend looking gorgeous, a lot of sunshine feeling very much like fall for next weekend. That's your forecast. I'll have another look at it tonight at 10 on the CBS 42 News at 10. Otherwise, have a great rest of your weekend, everybody.